This video will demonstrate how to add tools to the SWDCAM library. The library has three sections. A tools library, a tool aggregates library, and a machining library, where operations can be saved and later reused. Today we'll look at the tools library. A right-click in the background and edit will open the library in another window. From here, we can create new tools or edit existing tools. We can organize our tools using whatever folder structure we want. I'll create a new library and rename it. I'll create a subfolder and call it Finished Mills. In this folder, I'll create a new tool. There are many different types of tools to choose from. This will be a finishing cutter. And I'll call it 15 millimeter mill. We enter the tool information, the diameter, the end angle, the flute length, and the overall tool length. We assign a tool number, the spindle direction, a spindle speed, the cutting feed rate, the plunging feed rate, and a couple of default parameters, such as whether it's climb cut or conventional cutting, and the maximum depth of cut. The tool has been added to our library and is ready to be used in an operation. The videos that follow will focus on different machining operations using this tool.